Hello friends. According to Board Panda, the Animal Cruelty Division in Austin, Texas, got a report in November regarding what seemed to be a dead dog laying in a dirty box. When the police came, they discovered a dog that was starving to death, terribly underweight, and coated in excrement. When investigator Ava Wagner looked more closely, she saw that the dog's rib moved. Officer Wagner told the Huffington Post, We noticed, the dog, was alive, but very barely, so we transported her to the Austin Animal Center where veterinarians began emergency care. She wasn't moving at all, and her temperature was too low to to register on a thermometer. We didn't believe she had a chance of surviving. But Elizabeth Mancera, the veterinary assistant, came to the rescue like an angel. She provided the dog with life-saving care for the ensuing several hours. In order to assist the dog boost its body temperature, the doctor also gave her a warm bath and gently put a blow dryer on her. According to Mancera, during those first several hours I just chatted to her and assured her she was loved. After giving the puppy the name Sophie, she came to the conclusion that she should take in this brave little survivor. The dog is in excellent health and cherished by her new family. Elizabeth promises that she'll never miss another meal and she'll never be chilly again. I am certain about that. Officers were called about what seemed to be a dead dog laying in a dirty crate back in November. When they arrived, they saw a dog that was very malnourished and coated in excrement. Detective when Ava saw the dog was still alive, she hurried her to the doctor. We didn't believe she had a chance of surviving, she was given a warm bath by the veterinarian Elizabeth Mancera, who also used a blow dryer to increase body warmth. I spoke to her the entire time. She was shivering and drenched, and her eyes beseeched me. Everyone believed she would pass away. I kept assuring her everything will work out. Mansara chose to adopt the puppy she had given the name Sophie. She won't again go without food or experience the cold again.